Here, my friends, pick one, pack one, fresh pack, fresh draft. Got the Squee Dubious Monarch, it's a good one. Uh, other good cards, Infantry's great, Skyrider's good, Call's fine. You need tricks and removal to back Squee up. So hopefully we can find some. I like Extinguish more than Cut Down. If we're going to choose one of the black cards here, probably am. Yeah. It's like Extinguish, then Cut Down, then Lookout, then maybe Land. Land actually might be higher than a lot of those, but we'll take the Extinguish. This back is bad. Cyclops is good with Squee, but I think Cyclops is just a bad card. Excuse me, generally. Uh, but this pack is really not doing it for me. Uh, we're not taking Portal. You know what we could try to do? We could try to do the red-black sack deck. It's not nearly as good in this format, but you do have the four mana Thrall in the pit that nobody wants, and you have Bone Splinters, Cyclops, Horse Works, uh, Barricade Works... You know what? I'm going to take it. I hate this card, but I'll take it. Hmm. There is a fourth pick geyser, and this card is just really, really nice. Yeah, best card in the pack by far. Two good picks here. All right. Well, Garna goes with my first three picks. There's a bog. Cavalier's great. What is going on? We can get sabotages at any time. I think we're going to take one of the card draw effects here. I kind of like taking Thrill over Shadow Prophecy since three mana spells are so easy to get. I don't know if I was supposed to pass the Iconoclast. This is like the fourth charge we've seen. All right, first Blessing over second Thrill is all right. I don't think this is a huge sign. Joint Exploration is just okay. Yep, Death Touch on the Cyclops is a Wombo. Man, 40 gems, 8th pick. Soul Tender's good, though. What's up, Gregorius B? Thanks for the A9, Monza Prime. Dang, wield the Captain's Call. Should I take that and stay open? Uh, second Soul Tender is still pretty good. And I think the Captain's Call has higher upside. There's the Thrall to the Pit. Sorry. Steel Crusher. Yeah, Barricade is not bad, even if you're more of an aggressive deck. Damn, late Espionage. Do, do Splat's fine. Alright. This deck's fine. I didn't want any charges anyways if we're going to end up in straight red-black. And if, no, if you're a heavy white deck, which was still a possibility, I mean, we're not necessarily straight up red-black for sure, but in any heavy white deck, Captain's Call's really good. I don't open Shouldred. I get past Shouldred. Silly. Hey, there's your charge you were talking about. <laughs> oh boy, a second Thran portal. How lucky. Um, do I need the bog? No. Infusion, monstrosity. Keldon's okay if we want to splash a little bit of white. I kind of dig taking the infusion over the bog. I don't think we're going to need bog if we're just straight two color. Nice pack. My picks in order, I think, are Strike, then Rager, then Twinferno, then Sengir Connoisseur, then Urborg. 
Really good pack, though. Mm. Timing out the Rhino. Nice. Ooh, ooh, man. Another juicy pack. Sage, and then Rager, and then Tribute, and then Picker. Looking for that Legomos. Another Extinguish is nice. Planning on wheeling the Thrall. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. We're getting some good removals. Some solid creatures. Hmm, I don't need to be in black. I lose two Extinguish and Garna, everything else is just okay. There is a world where white could be a thing, very unlikely, but... Ah, I'm not gonna splash the Ellis. Yeah, if I had fixing right now I would, but we'll just... This is the third Rage of this pack, right? And so another Enthrall is gonna wheel. Uh, I need to get some, what, bone splinters and a horse, perhaps, if I want these to be really good. I mean, they're still fine if you can cast them for seven or whatever, but... I only have one two-drop creature right now, so I'm going to go with Picker over any of these, I think, probably slightly better threes. Nine, ten, Ouija! Thanks for the Prime, Subby. Dum 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 dum. I don't think tribute's worth it here. Again, I'm not big on splats, but they're okay. Jeez. Well, I have to bolster my Talarian Terror number one picked card in this format, so. Uh, is this good here? Make it like a five mana five five trample sometimes. GG's. Oh, another picker's on the wheel. Did not? Did we not wheel any of these thralls? No, we should start getting them soon, right? Maybe. Hey. Okay. Hey, okay. Oh, this is actually the first sabotage we've seen since the first pack. Um, gosh, here I actually want to just take the land since we have so many playables already. I don't really mind losing out on any of these. I think I don't need the Twinferno. I like it, but yeah, we'll take land. Could splash Tori? No white fixing. Probably just gonna take two drop over Kabu. Uh, yes, we're at four two drops right now. How many three drops do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, that's fine. The Rager. I think the monstrosity is gonna end up being a cut. And I'm probably just going to end up getting one of the sabotages on the wheel, and then that's going to be the deck, or something close to that. We still have quite a bit of time to get another really good card, though. Still early enough in pack three, and the colors have been settled. I guess we're going to probably end up cutting the barricade, because if you think about it, the barricade doesn't really do much with Enthrall to the Pit. If I have seven mana, I can just kick it anyways. I still like this card as a way to sack for value, but without like a cult conscripts, that might not be as necessary. Tribute is just minus two, minus two here. Ridgeline does nothing. Okay, that's still fine. There we go. Got a splinters. Nice. That'll replace the Tribute. Mr. Sprout's just good as a 2-2. Two -two. 
All right, that's the deck currently. Mm. Let's take the second Bone Splinters because there are a few that can wheel again, right? This could actually be another Heirloom deck. I don't think we need any of these. That's a maybe. Oh, wait, no, it was the sabotages that I was trying to wheel, not thralls. I can probably cut like one soul tender, just keep all the two drops. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, 13. Yeah, we can probably shave it down to one bone splinters instead. Shouldn't need two sabotage. Yeah, I'm planning on sixteen lands. I guess the monstrosity gets a little bit better when I'm adding the heirloom. If I'm adding the heirloom. Mm -hmm. Alright. Let's figure this out. Uh, removal is actually pretty good. To extinguish, strike, infusion, splinters, and then if we get... Any of our synergy pieces, double thrall. I guess with this much removal, maybe we don't need the heirloom to push through. Might just be better to run just like another random creature. I don't have any more twos that I want to run, do I? Amplifier. Could just run tribute as a minus two, minus two again. A a a tribute would just be a secondary infusion, effectively. Yeah, maybe I'll run the possibility. Throws another hit off of unenlisted flame sage. I guess no. Let's run the tribute over thrill. We have two pickers already. All right, we'll go like this. Slightly more. Black pips than red. Um, But we have a couple of red activated abilities and we don't need the extinguishes on turn four. I have two black two, <clears throat> two drops where I have one, two, three, four red two drops. All right, I'm going to go heavier red here. Both the double red cards are creatures that want to come down on their turns. Yeah, that's fine. These sort of hands make this deck look bad, though. <laughs> We have a little bit of flood insurance in our deck, right? With double thrall, though. Getting to seven is not that bad. I like their goblin more than mine. Mm. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and mind rot here for mana efficiency purposes. While it's true, I might not even be doing anything next turn. They're at 20. I think this deck can actually grind out rather reasonably. Damn! Double spell! That was good. That was very good. Oh. Uh-oh.
Well, I might be dead here. Oh, okay. Phew. Hold. Hey, and they took a turn off. All right. They might be drawing two creatures here, but they're good. Or we're good. There are some moments where you can play around things, but that wasn't one of them. Let's see. Well, I definitely do not want them to have Green Widow. Brawler's a 3-3. Could give them two land creatures. How many cards do they have in their hand? Three right now. Ah. Oh, that was good. Oh man, this is so tempting just to get the Cyclops online. When we have Blessing in our hand. So they're gonna go like Kicked Goblin and then Nishoba. Oh, that's okay too. Take their turn off. Okay, it resolved. Ugh. They have so many spells in their hand is the, the biggest problem here. I guess they're grabbing another forest. That's pretty good. Alright, well let's let's go to combat first. And see if this finds anything good. Okay. Okay. They're gonna play some chonkers though. We know they have at least four spells in their hand. Swamp, off the top, swamp, swamp me, swamp, swamp. That extinguish would have been super nice to hit. Oh, I can kick it too. Oh. Man, I was going to just <laughs> Another sweet play would have just been to take in the lone speaker to unlock a second black source, but <laughs> Oh god, we're dead. I'm, I'm snap blocking here. And probably still just dying to freaking... Whatever you call it. Colossal. Homie, where's my black source? Swamp, please! Swamp! Oh, dude. I can put him to two? No more instants and sorceries to hit since Spl uh, Splinters is on the bottom. I think I sit back. Ah! Please work. Yeah! No! 
Well, that sucks. What can you do? This game was so easy if we just hit a second swamp. Literally the easiest game in the world, and then we just never found a second black source. Hands great. I'll lead with the picker. So if I don't draw land next turn, I'm probably going to loot away. It's fine. All right. Phew. badly do I want to get scattered? I guess I'm okay with the splatter getting scattered. Oh, they don't have it. It almost discards picker, or rather squeed of the picker here if we wanted to. Okay, now we have a new game plan. Let's tribute this, extinguish that, smack for six. Still attacking. Risky. Oh, sure. Uh, okay. That was counter check, but they didn't even get priority with anything. <clears throat> Mystic. Nice try. Nice try, picker ability. This is really disgusting. How much harder would it be if your oath piece used full control? I mean, you'd still would run into stuff. It would just feel worse. Like, I always hold full control whenever I play a big event. Any arena open or qualifier, something like that. Hey, grats on diamond. I guess it didn't matter which one they bounced. There was no coming back. Nah, that was just troll a little bounce. Win rate, red, black. Yeah, red, black. My overall record is 11 and 16. First, curve out, don't punt. It's true, those are the rules of magic. Well, we milled one of our uh, extinguishes, so I can't get mana screwed with it anymore. Eh, I'll never draw it.
Geothermal. Womp womp. Hey, we drew the second black source. See? Extinguish is alive and kicking. What exactly is a nummy? It's like a tasty food. Maybe I should have just lightning struck the horse and smacked with both. I thought I was just going to be casting Sabotage kicked, but decided I'd rather hold a blessing for my Cyclops now. Could have also killed, just struck the Warhorse second main phase after they didn't do anything. I don't know. Hey. Guess what? I think I'm happy I kept the lightning strike around. So many tempting, juicy plays. No block? Huh? Okay. Huh. Uh, well, they are pretty darn close to dead here. Every time I throw something with Cyclops, it pings for one to their face, and then one to any other target. Or one additional target could be the same. We have three damage here with Sabotage. Plus two life. All right, force him to chump with the King Darien. Why would they double block? We still have two uh, enthralled of the pit in our deck somewhere too for the act of trees and win. Still have our soul tender waiting. <sighs> ah, more possessions! 
Knock it off! I mean, I guess they're just chomping with their knight? Sure. Wow, they're really sandbagging lands for uh, sabotage. Interesting. I think I'm gonna soul tender here instead of sabotaging. Go grab another creature. I mean, what are they gonna do here? back. They have a third Urborg? <laughs> oh, that's fine. Is a double block good there for them? I don't think it is. I kill both their creatures. Well, maybe they just need to get the Garn off, though. <clears throat> Remember, Darien poops out tokens and grows. If they want to, they can just put a counter on Darien and... whatnot. Chat, you can't assume everybody is ghosting. I haven't seen any play that would make me think otherwise. Ooh, that's almost really good here. Should do her. What should it do her? Let's go to the pits with you. All right, what are we now? Two and one, three and one, eight and one, uh, two and one, two and one. Jeez. 50% is a lot to believe in getting another 7 wins. Alright, fine. Let's kill it. I figure since it's minus two, minus two, I don't need to play around like the indestructible trick or whatever. Time to mill a bunch of cards. Extinguish, Thrall, and Strike. What the fu- three removal spells gone. Well, that's not good. 
Why couldn't there be three lands? Milius, thanks for the 31. Sweet. Trade's great. You got me. Rager, land, land. I don't really mind if they make me sack this old tender just to get in for a little bit of lifelink. Mm. Uh, confidence is very low this game. Sure. Hit me for five, make me sack the soul tender now. Ooh, go wide. That's nice. Uh, yeah, kick it. Okay, we're actually not doing too badly anymore. Uh, minimum is 60 cards. You can play as many as you want, though, in Constructed. This is good enough. Nice, 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 nice. Very nice. The only downside about this is that if they have a destroy evil, I'm now giving them a target. Herbs and spices time. Ooh. Ooh! So many oohs in the chat. Let's go! Looking bad for a moment, but then, uh, then we started doing things. It all started with the Mind Rot to get them off of their last two spells. Okay, that was good. What's chat even talking about? I'm about to ban everybody, and by that I mean... Emotes! Moat, 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 emote, moat, 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 emote. All right, you can get out of prison now. Joda, I think we got the five. Land. Y'all. Y'all. Squee pretty good versus Academy Wall. Let's go. And they do nothing? Y'all. Y'all. Multiply. Oh. 
More. More. What's up, Cri Grim King? Thanks for the prime subby. This is what happens when a squee goes unanswered, I guess. Whether it be by opponent getting kind of screwed over here or otherwise. Do I need to worry about anything that they could do for three or four mana? Because I kind of want to just go like, bleh. <laughs> I brought my goblin tribal deck. Oh god, the Elder Dragon War. <laughs> That would have been pretty funny if they had it. What do we need? A swamp, I guess? Oh, speaking of defenders. There's our swamp. Splinters, Rage, and Extinguish. Man! Our herders are really good at milling like three removal spells. Very, very good. Whoa! We're drawing, baby! Let's go! Cards, cards, cards for me. Drawbridge booty. Coolio! Thank you for the 24. Uh oh. Here it comes. Oh. Oh, they have multiple blight piles. That's pretty good. No! Bad my splinters is gone. Ooh, baby. Here they come now. I'll do this. This is annoying. Another sentinel and pile were discarded. J third! Three piles! Sheesh! And possession on two more piles. <laughs> oh my god! Incredible. A lot of pileage. Okay. I don't think we're doing that poorly. Are you another Urborg? Come on with these last cards in your hand! Help! All right, well. Oh. 
I think we're getting back the Flame Sage. Goblin, there goes my Cyclops and another Picker. I don't think they have a Chaplain, I think they just have three piles. Three piles and infinite recursion. Okay. They couldn't have three Urborgs, right? It's actually not that bad. This is a decent Flame Sage deck. What are you talking about? Favorite color combo? <laughs> Probably red blue. Or actually blue black. Pretty good. Slowly but surely, we're grinding out the damn walls. Oh god, I'm gonna deck. How many more win cons do I even have in this deck? I only have Squee? Oh no. I don't have enough win cons. I have a Squee and a Rager. And do we know where the Squee is? Yeah, I think we deck out. I'm pretty sure we lose this game. <laughs> Unless they just rattle off like four lands in a row. Uh... Oh my lord. We're dead. Freaking dead.
I don't have any enough. I don't have enough ways to win. Jeez. Oh yeah, yeah. No, we had very few spells left, and the spells that we did have weren't gonna be good enough. They had three blight piles, like three draw bridges, three sentinels, um, two Urborg re uh, repossessions. So. Could have also just milled three lands. Oh no, not again! Why? Why? Oh, okay. I like seeing that. Yeah, wait, what the heck? One mana, three toughness, two mana, three toughness, two mana, three toughness. I don't normally do stips for normal formats. Oh, their hand must suck. I think they kicked it, yeah. Yeah, their hand was really bad. I have no idea how many birds I've made before. I would estimate probably like 20. 2020. 20. But who knows? I really care about their flyer. That's fine. If they play something big and scary, we can kick the thrall here. Ah, oh, viewership's been really good for Dominaria. Even without boosting. I don't know how much boosting actually does. No complaints, though. Thanks, everybody, for tuning in and supporting. Uh, I'm only going to attack for six here. I think we're going to draw some cards with the Goblin. I guess I should just main phase. In case we hit a relevant spell. Probably should have done this before attacking. Alright, well. Good enough, I guess. Mm. Oh boy, here we go. The ad incentive program. Yeah, uh, yeah, we got a few emails about it. I didn't. don't think it really affects me. Hey! So I can steal it and then sack it to itself instead of kicking. Woo! If they double block one of my 2-2s, two they take a bunch of damage, so I like doing this. More importantly, plus one card.
Tasty barricade. There it is. There it is. It finally showed up. Woo, 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 woo. Okay, we'll do that instead. That seems very good. Yeah, taste it. Sheesh. I'm going to have them figure it out because I don't want to. <laughs> Uh, I assume this is good enough. They might not die, but they're in a bad spot. They figured out. Uh, is it good or is it great? Once the Mystic dies at end of turn, the Garna also pings him for an extra one. Oh! Gross! What the fuck? At least I draw 500 cards. Wow. That was just... Quite the top deck. So anyways, hand dump. Okay, what's left? I'm out of thralls. I have Battle Rage, Splatter Goblin, Tribute, Picker, Steel Crusher, two Soul Tenders, Rager, Extinguish, Cyclops. Yeah, we have a lot. A lot of goodies. Oh! <laughs> yep. Yeah. Haha, now you must chomp with the chap. The chap chomp. Haha. <laughs> Get him. Mill my other soul herder. Get him. Oh, didn't mill the other one. Let's go! These games have been very long versus the Defender decks. Okay, I'm gonna keep this. Got removal and discard and yeah, just need to find some lands. Everybody has that. I sw how many games now has it been? Turn two missionary versus us. Three, four. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> what? What? Nani? Probably just have another missionary. Can't win if they do. I really want to play out this sabotage, but I think we're going to wait one more turn. Need to find lands. All right, milled two sp two spells and a land. Oh god, we need a swamp so badly. Yes, come on, they're hell bent. Give swamp, please swamp. If we can kill the freaking connoisseur, I think we uh. Are looking, yeah. If we kill the connoisseur, they'd have nothing, and we have so much gas.
Please, I need land. Don't mana screw me out. So the kind of sewer grows. Swamp, 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 swamp. Uh, so now I need to tr trade with a soul tender, and then their soul tender gets back their missionary. I mean, technically, any untapped land next turn would also work, but ideally we just find Swamp. Please, cheese, and thank you. Man. Ah, they keep ripping spells. Good. Okay. I go down to five. We're actually not looking the worst. So hit him for five, then while still in combat, while the creature is still attacking. So I draw a card, because we don't care about them losing one life. We'd rather find some more juice. We need them to brick, like, one more turn. I mean, bricking as in activating their Soul Herder. I think I would have played up to three in this deck. Since we have like, what, four something ways to sack. I don't know, how much how much life have I lost as a result of not having... Um, second Swamp here. I guess it's actually better to go this and this. So we can draw and look for swamps here. I mean, it was a crazy amount of flying damage we took from the connoisseur as a result. Problem is, they're probably just gonna go grab, like, Shield Wall Sentinel, so we're probably dead. Oh my gosh. This is really unlucky. Now, remember, we only have one more red source than black, but this is multiple times now where... Oh, well, that'll do it. So I go to one. I kill Ellis first. I go back up to four. Uh, I guess I'm not technically dead, but... Bro! Oh, 
Well, found it. Eh, what can you do? What can you do? I feel like a lot of the games we lost, we got very unlucky. Now, maybe we weren't going to win that. No, because if we had the second black source, we just killed a connoisseur and we've gained like how much life off of that. I don't know, dude. How many games did we lose because we missed on a second black source, even though we're 8-7? Feels so, feel so bad. Oh, well. GG's. That was one of the better red-black decks I've uh, drafted. This had pretty good removal, pretty good card advantage. Right? Enthralled to the pit, pretty nice two-for-one type-ish effect. Sabotage, two-for-one, some other good removals. Cyclops actually did a decent bit of work, though we never got to... Uh, Death touch it. Garna always good, of course. Yep, that's magic, baby. Sometimes it's just not meant to be. I think I could have run 17 lands in this deck, too. I think we had enough grind out. Like, these want 5 mana. The Soul Tenders do. Um, Ragers draw a bunch of cards. It, you know, we have creatures that can help get rid of lands if we're drawing excess, so... Could definitely have seen running 17 instead. But that was, again, multiple games where we just got stuck on one black source and then both of our extinguishes in hand kind of sucked. GG's! Alright, good day overall, though. Let's take a peek, see what was our overall record on the day. Keldon's in the 50 months. We went 5-3 and three there, 7-1. Oh, we went 2-3 and three with that red-green deck. Again, I thought I think that was kind of unlucky. Five and three, seven, two. Yeah, not not too bad. Basically, when I...